May Fieldwork by Jenna Hutchison. Starting with the picture comparisons. And there's the selfie from me with a tree in the background. So first picture, we have September 2017 and May 2018, comparison side by side. Um, in this picture, as seen in the shot of the bench, the May picture seems to be much more vibrant and lively than that of the September photo. Uh, there are less leaves covering the ground in the May picture and the grass appears fuller. Um, there's more sunlight that may be chalked up to the time of day. I believe they were taken around the same time in the late afternoon, sometime around then. From what I can tell, there's a tree in the background that looks like, um, it looks very dull in the August picture, but very prominently purple in the May picture. Um, moving on to picture two, very similar to the first photo, there are less leaves on the ground in May, and the lighting is better. Uh, both of the trees are full of leaves, but I know that over the winter, the tree dropped its leaves and regrew them. You can see that the path in the May photo is still wet from recent rainstorms. This coming of spring showers is part of the reason why the grass and trees have been able to grow so well. Picture three, the bushes in the May picture look much bigger and fuller than they did in September, but based on the cubic shape of the bushes from last fall, that would be because those bushes were freshly trimmed while they were not trimmed in May. Again, less leaves on the ground in May, uh, brighter colors as well. Evidence of moss doing the things moss do. As for the moss, the moss is growing up the tree in response to the rain because the moss needs water. It grows up the tree when it rains so that it has better access to water. So this shows the beginning of it growing up the tree and a little bit up the bark, but mostly it's like it starts from the ground, it's growing up the roots, it's going up to the rest of the tree. Additional notes, my 100 word reflection my experience with AP Bio this year was particularly stressful with workload from all of my classes, and even though AP Biology was one of the classes which gave work most frequently, I enjoyed the content very much. Um, I'm really happy that I completed this course sooner rather than later. Uh, I felt well prepared for the AP exam, and I just genuinely enjoyed the class. Uh, the labs were fun, the readings were really interesting, and the classroom environment was amazing. Uh, Ms. Franskoviak was an awesome teacher to have. Uh, my classmates and I worked really well together in and out of the classroom. It's been a great year, guys. Thank you.